of the major criticisms that you often hear about remote working is that you can't build a proper culture when teams are virtual. But I'm here to tell you that that's absolutely nonsense because culture is not based on proximity. It's not based on physical locations. It's based on a set of shared ideals and shared expectations. When everybody knows what they should be doing, when it's clear what the outcomes you're looking for, then people can collaborate and achieve those. And that is not dependent on a physical building or proximity. In fact, in many times when there is a physical building and proximity, what happens is, yes, you get a pseudo culture. Part of it is based on the mission of the company and the expectations, but a lot of it is also based on the dominant personalities that exist within that location. So your virtual team is in fact a lot more egalitarian if you like, and it's a great opportunity for you to set the proper expectations, uh, the shared outcomes that everybody is aiming for, be results oriented, empower people to achieve them and collaborate and work together and then you're actually going to have one of the most results and oriented and dynamic cultures possible.